Welcome back to another video everyone. So as you all know, Americans online like to make memes about British meals all the time. More specifically, beans on toast. What are you doing? Oh, you want to get closer for the beans? Yeah. You're going to be eating that. What do you think? What do you think about it? Gross. Well recently I've been fortunate enough to meet up with my girlfriend who just so happens to be American. Today she's going to be trying beans on toast for the first time. Now I've made videos about beans on toast before and I've, you know, recommended it to Americans saying, you know, if you hate on this, if you think it looks disgusting, just try it before you hate on it. But this is different though because I'm going to be the one making it. I've had people send me photos of their beans on toast and it doesn't look very good to be honest and then I'm not surprised why they don't like it. Now the only difference is I'm not in my usual setup that I would make beans on toast in. I'm in a different kitchen, we've got different ingredients here so I'm not entirely sure how it's going to turn out. Typically I use Asda's own baked beans because they have a very nice bean to sauce ratio but again we don't have the same ingredients here so today I'm going to be using Morrison's own baked beans in tomato sauce. This should do the trick. Honestly, looking at this in the pan, it does look very similar to Asda's own. And usually I wouldn't really toast my uh, bread that much because that's just how I like it. So this is all personal preference. So how do you want your toast? Do you like it? How, how do you like it? I like mine toasted. Toasted. That is what a toaster does. I'll toast as you, I'll toast it, I'll toast as you want it. Now I think what I might do just to help with the flavor is add a bit of cheese onto it. Fortunately, this is the only cheese I have. Usually I would grate my own cheese, but we've only got sliced here, so. Waiting for the bread now. And then we're gonna Don't just... forget the cheese. Yeah, you put no, the cheese you put on. The cheese on. First. How do you know? You're not the beans no, on toast expert. Double heat. So the cheese is underneath. That's a bit of an unusual thing. Now we're not going to go for any Squidward bites here. So I'm going to cut her first slice just to make sure that you know she takes a good amount. Then we're going to just slice about this much. You have to give a ten out, uh, a rating out of ten. Six? Okay, I'll, I'll accept that. Based on how you were speaking about it before, I thought you were maybe going to give it a two or a three. The fact that you're taking more than one bite is a good sign. I mean, how can you not enjoy a meal that looks like this? <laughs> so that is an American trying beans on toast. As you can see, she's enjoying it very much. I believe she just told me that it actually shifted from a six out of 10 to an eight or nine. That part of the video corrupted, I can't include that, but but this is proof that beans on toast taste better than it looks. But yeah, that is gonna be it for this video, everyone. I'd say it was a success. I have successfully, I've successfully put someone else onto beans on toast. Why? Okay, now that's a crime. Why are you going in the middle of, wait, why are you going in the middle of the bread? So just like I said in my other Beans on Toast videos, if you're an American and you look at this and think, wow, that looks shit, how can they eat that? Try it. What was that? <laughs> Try it, but make sure you actually make it correctly. So yeah, thank you for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. Definitely subscribe if you're new here and I'll see you all in my next video.